Mm-hmm. I know tier three is touching 150, uh, 180, 190. Uh, once you get into principal and once you get into like senior, senior principal roles, you're in, up here, you know, it, now we're talking about IR, right? So IR, instant response, tier three, 170 to 180. Yeah. For tier ones, depending on where you at. You get between seventy five or ninety. That actually went up. It used to be fifty five. Yeah, it's up. It's up. But but they up they up there seven five ninety maybe right under a hundred for tier one. If you're lucky, you get ninety five, ninety ninety five as a tier one for sock work. You know what I'm saying? And you hit on something. I forgot what it was. I kind of lost my train of thought. Um. About the, what about the the cost? Like I said, like one forty or something like that. One twenty, one forty, something. No, nah, it was before that. It was about the uh, looking MSS. At the, looking at the job description. Oh, job description, learning skills, make your lab. Making a lab job description. It was something along those lines. When I remember, I'm gonna, I'm gonna okay. come back because it, it's a, a it was along the lines of competitive, being competitive in the game and and, and standing out. Um, but I, when I remember, I'll bring it back up. Okay. I had it. I'm it, it, it. Oh, shoot. KF Tech in the building right now. Salute to KF Tech IT support. You got, you got really good content, sir. I, I just want to throw that out there. I don't know you, but your stuff is good, dog. For help desk. Anybody looking for help desk, go look. I, I've been sending that YouTube page to people. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah, man. He about to be at like 50,000 subs pretty soon, man. He's hey. truth. It's good stuff, dog. Um, yeah, but I know you was talking about that. You stopped on tier one for for pay because I know okay. this is like DMV scale, right? Or DMV, you want to average DMV scale? Because okay, I don't know, yeah, yeah. I ain't been nowhere else. So that right. uh, that's from average seventy five, low hand low fives seventy five to ninety, maybe under a hundred. Tier twos, if you if you're doing it right, tier twos start a hundred. 115 ish to 125 or 135 so you can range between one if you if they give you 100 for tier two that's too low so if you do 115 depending on your skills depending on your skills you can get 135 to be a tier two all right um because they got to make money as a company right the company got to make money is actually higher than that but if you tier three I've seen people in their tier threes 150 and up. Mm-hmm. I know tier threes touching 150, uh, 180, 190. Uh, once you get into principal and once you get into like senior, senior principal roles, you're in... up here. You know, it, now we're talking about IR, right? So IR, instant response, tier three, 170 to 180. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Maybe maybe 190 if you if 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 you if you you know if you know how to work the system. Right. Um, but yeah, you can make some pretty good dough doing the cyber stuff and and uh, like doing the sock stuff and IR. You know, I think IR is a bigger bag than sock. Well, you way. know, they rolling them like the companies I've been interested in like talking to. Yeah. There is no difference. They're all together. So they're just okay. a fire team. Hey, listen, you I work that thing. And listen, here's another here's another cheat code. Go 1099. And you'll get more. Because now you take away the tax, take away you gotta pay your own health care now. Yeah. So if you was doing a second gig, that's why I say anybody in the field that's in it right now, you have your little W two, that's cool. But if you're trying to get a second job in the same field, go 1099 because they give you it's cheaper for them to pay you straight out the pocket right? and not have to it worry is. about taxing it and giving you benefits and all this other stuff like that. You you can you can walk out of there with 200,000 if you do it right. Sure. Or let me ask them, do they do? I be I tried to uh, hit them up with that. Hey, I do business to business. So I'm really going to run it. Yeah. Up. Court to court. Court to court. Hey, hey, <laughs> hey. 
You know, Max probably been eating good this year. You know what I'm saying? Hey, and that's what's and that's what's gonna ask you about now, so we can get into is it. like, well, for one, it's the DMV. So I feel like everybody in the DMV got their own company. <laughs> well, yeah, yeah, and no, because there's some people in the DMV that's okay with coexisting. They're okay with their little check and they and they carry out every Friday. Meanwhile, <laughs> I mean, you, I'm hey, trying I, to eat everything. You Listen, got to because it's. I eat what he don't eat. You know what I'm saying? It's a, it's expensive <laughs> up there, man. Like I remember when you were telling me what you was talking about. I t- I talked to yeah. her, and I I, I got to get her on the channel too. She was dope. She did some um, pen tests and the other stuff. She worked for Visa. Oh, nice. and so she had referred me to a, a role, but they wasn't talking about like he wasn't talking about nothing when they was talking about the pay in. It was trying to require you to move out there. I was like, oh no, Listen, I was like, Listen. nah, that's that's not it, Slim. <laughs> the, the cheat code. And I tell you, I tell everybody this: If you step in, even in, even if help desk, even in help desk, eventually you're gonna pivot out of help desk. Like we said mm-hmm. before, don't stay there more than a year. You should already. It's a gas station. You should already have your cert or whatever you need to do. You should already know where you need to go after a year, right? Get your clearance right. if you're gonna get one, get it, and and start picking where you need to go because that's where those tickets are going, right? But if you stepping in, I tell everybody this. Start your LLC. Here's the new cheat code. Look, look at listen to the market. All these different big companies laying on people. Big companies laying on people. Yeah. What do they got to do now? They got to go out and they got to find a company that's willing to pick them up. If you already got your LLC in, you're at a place, you know the customer, you could work a deal with the customer to pay you directly as your own company versus being an employee for somebody else that could just say you know what we're just gonna cut this group right here and that's mm-hmm. another reason why i started a company back in 2020. i ain't really yes. do nothing i ain't really do nothing crazy it wasn't until COVID where i said you know what let me take it serious 